Welcome to the broadcast. Our sign language interpreter is Damien Evans. The government has declared cessation of movement in and out of the county of Mandera for a period of 21 days. The order which took effect at 7 p.m. this evening was prompted by rising community-based COVID-19 transmissions in the border county, which has eight confirmed cases of coronavirus. Movement was banned as Kenya's COVID-19 cases rose to 303, following seven new infections. Our coverage of the coronavirus global pandemic continues. We begin tonight with KTN senior reporter Rita Tinina. On one side, Somalia. On the other, Ethiopia. The border county of Mandera has eight COVID-19 cases, two of them urban refugees. The eight cases confirmed in less than three weeks after the first case was recorded. As part of the containment measures, the government has today restrict, directed restriction of movement into and out of Mandera County. The cessation of movement by air and road effective 7 p.m. Wednesday, the 22nd of April, for an initial period of 21 days. Following the order, Mandera joins Nairobi, Mombasa, Kilifi, and Kwale in the list of counties where cessation of movement orders are in effect. Day 41 after Kenya confirmed its first COVID-19 case, and the numbers have now hit the 300 mark. Having tested 707 samples, we have seven persons who have tested positive to the disease. Six are from Mombasa, one from Nairobi. Five are male, two are female. The new cases bring to 303 the number of COVID-19 cases in the country. Nine patients have been discharged from isolation centers after testing negative. The country now has 83 recovery cases and mass testing is ongoing. Already, the Ministry of Health has approved the Nairobi Hospital to offer COVID-19 tests. The tests at the facility will cost you 10,000 shillings and you will get your results within 6 to 24 hours. On the global front, there are over 2.5 million COVID-19 cases with 179,000 deaths. In Africa, there are close to 26,000 cases. 1,200 people have lost their lives. Egypt has the highest number of cases, close to 3,500. Algeria has recorded the highest number of deaths, 392. In East Africa, of the six East Africa community partner states, Kenya has recorded the highest figures, 303 cases and 14 deaths. Tanzania has 284 cases, 10 deaths. Rwanda, 150 cases. Uganda, 61 cases. Burundi, 11 cases, one death, and South Sudan, four cases. Rita Tinina, KTN News. Tonight